Good morning everybody and welcome to today's vlog. So it's Monday and school is back and Bay is at work for one more week. I'm heading out now. Alright, see you honey. See you boys! Jackson is not awake yet which is surprising. I thought he'd be the easiest one to get up. Um, Jackson, uh, Caden is so I'm just going to give him his breakfast and then go and drag Jackson out of bed. But so for breakfast they're having a cross bun, apple and a yogurt. Alright, we got little Leah. Barely. Y'all ready? We are yes. out. Hey, we are out on He's Saturday. So I just got back from my midwife appointment. Everything's good. It was a pretty quick appointment, honestly. But this time I got the midwife that um, I had when I'm pretty sure I had her both times, like with the boys. So hopefully I get her this time as well. She's pretty cool. But anyway, um, not really much to update on. She's still very well down in my pelvis. Um, so that's good. Still not allowed gas at this point in time as a pain relief so all my bloods and the swab test came back fine um it's all got fancy words and stuff and i don't know what's called it's like gbs is fine hb 126 or something i don't know um i'm 37 weeks and two days and my belly is still measuring 35 weeks um, but she said it could be because the baby's like heaps far down into my pelvis like most of her is down there so that's fine. We didn't do my weight today because I've been staying at a pretty good weight. My blood pressure was a little bit higher but my blood pressure is naturally a little bit higher. I don't know if it's because of my heart condition or something like that. Um, and that's pretty much it. We, we, we did talk about pain relief and stuff still. She said, like, judging by my other ones, she doesn't reckon that I'll reach for the epidural, but if I do, like, it's fine. Um, she put in here, would prefer gas in labor, maybe hot water, maybe epidural, so. Yeah, um, she wants me to start doing some frequent, frequent walking. Um, so I'm gonna have to, she said just like a couple times a week, do a bit of walking or something to keep active or whatever. So I'll do that. But yeah, I'm happy with that. It's pretty good. So my next appointment is again next Monday and I'll be like over 38 weeks then. But I'm back home now. We didn't do any cleaning up from from any of the day yesterday. We pretty much just like hung out. Um, the kids had like hot chocolates and stuff to try and fall asleep. And then we got them to bed and then we went to bed. So I've got a bit of cleaning to do today. So I'm going to pot around and do that. And yeah, I'm not filming with time lapse because why not? I don't know if I've really talked about it in the vlog yet, but um, we are retaining Caden's bed and getting a refund and gonna get him a bed frame from somewhere else because that bed frame sucked like really bad. It Like we had to build supporting beams for it. Like the middle bar just didn't support anything. Like even if like you just sat on the bed, all the slats would come out. So we've got it packed up right there. We've got a bag of foam and stuff that was in the box because you have to return it in the box. So he's back to just sleeping on his mattress on the floor. We do have a, um, what's it called? A single mattress he can use for now. We just needed slats for it, but Mima said she's got some spare slats for a single bed. So we'll get them off her. And I think we also need the screws and stuff for the bed. Oh, just until we can get him a new one because that one sucked. Oh. But yeah, so we've got that all set up and the courier do whatever is going to come and collect it next week. Shit. I think Caden's lizard is dead. It's not moving. Okay, it's breathing. You freaking scared me, girl. What are you doing? Are you okay? I don't want to touch it. <laughs> okay, it moved. It moved. I guess it's a little heart beating, but I'm just making sure like it's okay. Caden's had this lizard for a while now and he loves it and looks after it and stuff so I'd be devo if it died. Anywho, let's get Caden's room done. <sighs>
I got um, a bunch of cleaning done, which you've seen, but I had to like sit down between each like room. So, you're all right, Cora. Oh my god. So, obviously, I got mine and Caden's room done. I tied up the hallway. Um, the baby's room and Jackson's room was already done. Clean the kitchen. So, I just have to do the lounge room, and then everything is like sorted and chucked some washing on and stuff. But it's time to go pick up the boys now. I'm really excited to hear about how their day went. Um, also, while I was sitting down, like resting between a room, I was like, oh my God, it'd be so fun to recreate some of Caden's old baby pictures. So I've been going through my old photo albums, picking out a couple of baby pictures. So we'll have to do like a little photo shoot thing. I think that'd be good fun. But anyway, I'm gonna go pick up the boys now and see how their day was. How was school? Good. Aren't you having the sandwich? Caden had his foot in PE, Usu as usual. Yeah, we have to get his insert sorted out again. How was school, Jack? Drink? Hey. I, I, I just said it was good. Drink? It's good. Um, cool. It's nice to see the therapy like that, isn't it? They've been pretty good lately. Like they, um, the whole time we've been at home, they've been doing like sleepovers in each other's houses, and, uh, each other's rooms. All right. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I'm so tired. Me too. All right, I think I'm going to start making tea. Get that done early because we're all super tired. Oh, yeah, Caden. Yeah. These are the photos I've picked out so far. I'm not sure about that one, but... Anyway, you can have two hours, so at six o'clock you got to get off, okay? All right. Anywho's, um, for dinner, I'm gonna make some cabana sausage rolls for the boys, because I have cabana, cabana that needs to get used. Um, yeah, the boys are gonna chill for a bit. All right, I don't think you're gonna be able to see it in the house, but I've smoked out the house because I'm making a garlic sauce and I went to sit down for five minutes and it like overflowed. So it burnt my stove top. I managed to get most of it off though, so I'll clean it properly when it's cooled down. But one downfall to this kitchen is you can't open this window and there's like no exhaust fan. So I'm just gonna have to like let it go away or something. I don't know. What a pain in my ass though. Alright, the boys' dinner's ready, so they're having those cabana sausage rolls, cucumber, and we went to Mima's and stole these drinks. <laughs> For dinner, for me and Jesse, we're having steak, garlic sauce, mashed potato, and like a cabbage bacon fry up thing. So it's gonna be a little while longer, but I had to feed the kids something easy because they're both like dead tired and they need baths and showers still and whatnot. So yeah. 